For the Beaver Radio Network, I'm Brian Schultz. BSU men's golf team took the first place trophy last week at the Upper Iowa Invitational in Waterloo. We are joined by sophomore Sam Otto out of Hastings. Weather was lousy. How much did that have a, a bearing on uh, on your score? Yeah, it was tough out there. Um, everyone had to play through it, but uh, the scores were definitely a lot higher than usual. Which is... You finished uh, in sixth at 14 over. All things considered, you happy with that score? Yeah, I am. It was uh, it was tough out there. It was hard to score well, so I'm happy about that score. Like you said, everybody had to play on the, in the same conditions. Um, what made it so that your team uh, was was still able to play so well? Um, well, I think we're kind of used to it playing up here in the spring. It's not always the best weather, so I think we're prepared a little bit. Uh, Will Zach was the medalist. Uh, he's a freshman. How happy are you that he's on your team and counts on your scorecard? <laughs> Yeah, it was nice to have him. I, I think he made nine birdies out there, which is just unhurt. I mean, it was unbelievable. It was nice. To, he was in front of me, so it was nice to see him play well. Like you mentioned, you don't play with your own teammates. You're playing with other guys from other teams. Can you feed off of uh, a guy either playing in front of you or behind you that you're, you're able to see him knocking a good shot? Are you able to feed off of that or not? Yeah, I think you are. Um, you kind of get some momentum from him and seeing that he's doing well you want to do well also so it's nice to see people do it good in front of you and behind you you're from hastings uh i've played hidden greens in hastings a time or two i've played uh mississippi national and red wing a time or two those are two of the better courses around that area out of those courses down south compared to the to the country club here um it's kind of similar uh tight tight fairways small greens fast greens very similar to down there does it help you I think it does. Just usually you have to hit it really straight off the tee and small greens, so you got to hit a lot of greens. You're also not far from Meesville, the home of the Llama Caddy. I've played there before, too. Have you ever used the Llama Caddy? I have not, but I've heard a lot of stories about it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what makes golf unique and fun, uh, especially on that course. The front and the back nine are so different. Do you play in, in tournaments and courses that are so different from front nine to back nine, either in uh, geography or terrain or anything like that? Yeah, I mean, I know I played a course in, um, it's, uh, in uh, somewhere down where I'm from, and the front nine's like link style. It's completely open, and the back nine's really tight and short. It's completely different. But. Uh, on a serious note, the NSIC championships are this week. This is what you guys are playing for all year. What's it going to take to carry over from last week into this week? Yeah, I think we just got to keep the momentum going and hopefully just post two good rounds. Have you played the course down in Missouri or not? Yes, I have. Uh, two weeks ago we played. How did you, you and the guys fare? Uh, we fared all right. We, we're looking forward to it, playing again, get some revenge on it. The second time in short order that you play a course, got to be a little easier, isn't it? Yeah, I think we, we know the course now, so we're very excited for it. Best of luck. Thank you.